ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದು ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯನಂದ ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೇ ರಾಧಿಕಾಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನೋ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ಪಾಸಿಂದು ಬ್ಯವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವುನೆ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂ ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೇ ಪರಮಾನಂದ ಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾ ಹೊಯ್ ತುಳಸಿದೇವ್ ವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಸಚ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರುಂಚೈವನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರೆ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರು ಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮೋದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ಭರಣ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನ ಭವಿಷ್ಠದೂಹ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವ ವಿರಂಜನು ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ವನುತಾಲ್ಯಭವಾಧಿಭೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೆ ಚರುನಾಥವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗಪವಧೂಷು ಅದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾ ಕಿಪಾಂಕರುಷಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನೀತನಂದ ಸಿಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭುನೀತನಂದ ಸಿಯದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತಬಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತ ಭುಜೌ ಕನಕಾ ಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈ ಕವಿತರ ಕಮಲಾಯತಾಕ್ಷ ಈಶಾಂಬರು ದ್ವಿಜರು ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೆ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿ ದಿವ್ಯಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯ ಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷಿ ತಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವಿಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ್ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಜಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಭೀತ್ವಂ ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ 
हरे कृष्ण हरे कृष्ण 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 हरे 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 राम हरे राम 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 हरे हरे जे बाम से किथो हृदार्था जने सुदेहांतर वार्तिकेश गेहेश जयात्म जाराति मत्सु न प्रीत युगता जबदार्थास्वलोके जे बाम से कितो हृदार्था जने सुदेहांतर वार्तिकेश गेहेश जयात्म जराति मत्सु न प्रीति युगता जबदार्था सुलोखे गौड़ीय गोष्ठीपति श्री शिल भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉक्टर प्रभुपा परमांश जगत गुरु टोल्ड दैट टू गिव पनिशमेंट एंड टू गिव कीपा अनुग्रह एंड निग्रह देर इज टू वर्ड अनुग्रह एंड निग्रह अनुग्रह मीन टू बेस्ट ऑफ कीपा ओपेनली निग्रह मीन टू गिव पानिशमेंट गुरु वैष्णव कैन रिजर्व बोथ द राइट गुरु वैष्णव समटाइम कैन गिव कीपा टू आस गुरु वैष्णव कैन गिव पानिशमेंट टू आस एक्सटर्नली पानिशमेंट मीन मोर कीपा सो गुरु वैष्णव कैन रिजर्व द राइट बोथ द राइट समटाइम कैन गिव पानिशमेंट टू आस Sometimes can give openly kipa to us, both kipa they can do. But common people, those who are ordinary people, they cannot understand. Always, because bonded soul, it is a disease. It is a disease to find fault with Guru Vishnu. they have no vaikuntha darshan vaikuntha darshan mean externally opposite situation but you will have to think it favorable externally opposite is not good very bad situation but still a pure devotee always looking it positively but bonded soul it is a chronic disease they can find fault with guru vishnu naturally first of all they cannot understand what is guru tatva all over the world i promise you all over the world if you can solve this problem only one problem i am not speaking about rasa leela nothing only if you can take the responsibility to rectify the guru vaishnav darshan wow who is guru who is vaishnav then all problem can be finished ultimately but this is problem basic problem they have misconception about guru vaishnav they have no idea they have no idea big problem so it is a chronic disease of bonded soul you know today i also i was speaking noon time that the son in law son in law a sarvam vata jajju he is going to find fault with chaitanya mahaprabhu who is supreme lord unnecessarily he have no idea who is guru vishnu nothing he want to find fault with chaitanya mahaprabhu Ramchandra Puri want to find fault with Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, but externally you can see that Ramchandra Puri has taken shelter of Madhubindu Puri. Come on, the great Madhubindu Puri. Still he is not at all disciple. 
main problem. Who can pass judgment? Who can pass judgment? This kind of judgment, who is Vaishnava, who is not, what is right, what is wrong, this kind of judgment we cannot leave in the hand of some idiot people. Those who are demonicate character, have money, position, everything. We cannot give this, we cannot give responsibility to them. Then you can judge who is Vaishnava, who is not. Because as per Srimad Bhagavatam, at present, as per Srimad Bhagavatam, money power is the best power. Vritva meva kalu ninam janma charo gunadayo. Vritva, money is all. If you have money, you can get big chair of Acharya, you can make big temple, but they have basic idea they don't have. Basic idea they don't have. Popat repeatedly used to say that by money power you cannot make a temple. By money power you cannot make a temple. You can have billions of dollars. By money power you can make a deserve. By money power you can make you cannot make a temple. By money power you cannot make a disciple who is just powerful, like Gaurakishwar Babaji Maharaj making only one disciple, who can save the whole world. But we are busy with thousands of monkey. In the name of disciple, monkey. We like to increase the number of monkey. Who can jump more, who can show so much. This is our Guru Tattva, Shishya Tattva, this is the problem. So, who is Vaishnava, who is not, this kind of judgment, we cannot live in the hand of some crazy people. Those who are crazy, because of money, power, these are the crazy. So, I like to live peacefully, don't disturb me. I like to live peacefully, don't disturb me. Prabhupada speaking, those who are speaking this way, those who are speaking this way, they are actually bogi. They can never do Hari Bhajan. Those who are speaking, let me stay peacefully. I don't like to be disturbed by anybody. You have taken diksha from anybody. You have any guru. If you know Guru Tattva, then you cannot speak this way. Diksha means, at the time of Diksha, you will have to give everything to Gurudev. Then you have no right, this building is my building. The money is this. You cannot speak. All you will have to offer to Guru Pāda. At least mentally. There should not be any false ego. This my money, my this. But if there is duplicity, then mentally also you cannot do. So Prabhupada used to say, Shauvari Rishi, you heard the name of Shauvari Rishi. You heard the name of Shauvari Rishi. Eh? After doing bhajan for 60,000 years, lost everything. So don't express false ego. Don't express that you have money, you have power, you have education, you have big pandit, you have so capacity to make full of whole people of the world. This capacity may be there with you. But our Gauriya devotee, they never want to be, ca be a canvasser. Canvasser, you know? Canvasser. Canvassing. Harikatha is not canvassing. One Harikatha, one character of Guru Vaishnava can change your whole life. That is called Harikatha. Follow what I say. So, false ego, what you can do? You can have some capacity, I know. But I told that a Gauriya devotee, pure Gauriya devotee, never going to demand anything from Guru Vaishnava Bhagavan. 
They never, they have no demand. They like to give everything. At all, if they have any speciality, like Goswami Maharaj, Madhav Goswami, they are very special devotees. Very special. Even Madhav Goswami Maharaj told, they, what kind of patience Madhav Goswami Maharaj have? When we, when we all are failure, Prabhupada wanted to make one temple in South India. Months after months, they are trying, they are just fed up. South Indian people, they cannot donate any land. They cannot cooperate with us to make it. This is impossible. Sridhar Goswami is speaking, well, we are trying for a long time. So we are failure. I think it's not possible. Then Parambhudya Madhu Goswami is speaking, we have not done, we have not done so much as yet. We have not done so much as yet. Yes. What do you say? Siddhar Goswami says, what do you say? Yes, this is called Madhu Goswami. This is called Guru Sheva. You know the person, you know the symptom of Guru Sheva? You are hearing Harikatha. If I ask you to speak, you speak me. What is the symptom of a pure devotee? What is the symptom of Guru? You cannot speak properly. You can speak, but properly you cannot speak. If properly you cannot speak, I am sure about it. I cannot digest. You can see, one Guru Sheva can never feel tired. It is a symptom. Continuous to do good, no tiredness. They can never feel tired to preach actual Siddhanta Vichara Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. We are very lucky. We are so lucky that you cannot even imagine how lucky. Because by the help of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami, Bhakti Mir Thakur, we are getting everything. I mean the ex exact teaching of Gorang Mahaprabhu. We are going to get the exact teaching of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. If Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is here in front of me, if Chaitanya Mahaprabhu is there in front of me doing different kind of Leela, I cannot understand. If I can, if I can get the chance, because Chaitanya Leela is eternal, Still today you can find Gauranga Lila if you are if you are pure enough. You cannot see any hotel, restaurant, nothing. Still today it is written. Confirm. Not written, confirm. Adda Pyo Shei Lila Kore Gaurai Kono Kono Bhagavan Dekhi Bare Pai. Still today, Gauranga doing same Lila. Some lucky man can see that Lila. Still today. You can find in Jaiva Dharma that two young boys from Sinatpur, that direction. Uh, uh, yes, this direction. Sinatpur. From that village. I mean Ruddhadip, not Ruddhadip, from you have to go more. It's called Sinatpur. If you can go across Chaitanya, you can ask people Sinatpur. Two young Man used to come to Raghunath Das Babaji Maharaj, who used to stay that time in Siva Sangar. After their diksha, they are very much interested hearing Harikatha day and night. And Babaji Maharaj speaking Harikatha like wind is a symptom, Prabhupada told. If you feel tired, Prabhupada told, if you feel if you feel tired, if you feel tired, disgusted in Harikatha Kirtan, you are not at all devoted. You are not at all. Maybe whole world can give stamp. Still you are not devoted. Papa told. The symptom of a pure devotee, he can feel enthusiastic mood all the time in Harikatha Kirtan. Because Chaitanya Mahaprabhu have shown Kirtan, how to do Kirtan. All devotees of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. What I mean to say, at the time of Diksha, 
I mean, they got diksha. For long time, they are taking shiksha, I mean hearing Harikat. After that, they requesting Babaji Maharaj to give diksha. Also, he was innocent, both of them. They are going to arrange Bandara, Bandara, you know, festival. Both of them going to arrange festival in Shiva Sangan. Follow, in Shiva Sangan, pure devotees are cooking, they are offering pure devotees, no contamination. At present, due to contamination, we are in confusion. Whom to follow, how to follow. He is speaking right, or he is speaking right, how I can know. Now everybody in confusion. Or at all they are going to hear absolute truth, they have no power to digest. They can misunderstand. Hey, this is wrong. He is speaking all rubbish. That's why Bhakti Thakur told, that's why Bhakti Thakur repeatedly told, to think a Vaishnav as a Vishnav. Bhakti Thakur told, to think a pure Vaishnav, a Vaishnav, he is not, not Vaishnav, is very dangerous. And to accept a non Vaishnav, idiot, as Vaishnav, both dangerous. Bhakti Muttagur told, I can show you. To accept an idiot people, a sadhu, acharya, guru, is more dangerous. And to ignore a pure Vaishnav, that he is not Vaishnav, both dangerous. That's why Bhakti Muttagur told, after searching, after searching many, many countries, after searching many, many countries, many, many cities and villages, all pilgrimages, after making calm operation, still you can meet with one pure sadhu or cannot. It depends upon your luck. It depends upon your luck. You are getting one lakh dollar. It is not your luck. You think it is luck. You think you are getting one lakh dollar is very, I am lucky now. Not luck. It is bad luck. But when you meet with one pure sadhu, that is your luck. Bhakti Muttaka speaking, it's impossible. After searching so many you know, countries, so many cities, so many pilgrimages, so many... If you are going to meet with one pure sadhu, then you think you are so lucky. Because without the approval of Nithyananda Balaram, it is really impossible to meet with one sadhu. It is the arrangement of Nithyananda. Nithyananda watching your heart. No false ego. A pure devotee, you can test him. If you unnecessarily insult him, kick him, he cannot speak anything. Unnecessarily. He has done no, no wrong. And you insult him. You drive him away from your temple. Many times it happens so. They are not going to speak anything. Calm and quiet they can go away. But all danger coming in this society. Why those society they are like fire, burning? Why those society? Not even a single society. Not even a single society if you show me. They are all burning like fire. Fire. Because of aparat. Who can guide them? Nobody going to check them, no. They think we are all king. Everybody thinks that they are all king. They too we are king. Who are you? You are beggar. That's why, where, why there is a scarcity of Harikatha Kirtan? This was the question. This was the question by one devotee to Popa. Why there is a scarcity of Harikatha? You always speaking that there is a scarcity of Harikatha all over the world. Are so many people here speaking Harikatha? Well, no. Prabhupada is not foolish. So many Harikatha going on. Prabhupada saying, no. Harikatha, rare. There is a scarcity of Harikatha. Why? Prabhupada speaking, because, because, because we like to insult Guru Vishnu. We like to insult Guru Vishnu. Pure Guru Vishnu, even in the temple, we like to kick him out. Because if he is here, he is going to watch why I am, what I am doing. He is going to watch you know, my naked picture. He is going to watch. 
So better, many things happen. Even firing, even firing, that devotee speaking right. So before Arati, I am not going to speak the temple name. The fire, the devotee die. Immediately close everything, they clean the temple, put the devotee under mud, no police, nothing, no information. Direct evidence I have. Direct. They kill. Because he was speaking. He was speaking that he is not good. Why he was being? The better you can kill him. This is the situation at present. So Pope was speaking, at present the scarcity of Harikatha. Why? Because we like to drive our pure Guru Vishnu. We don't like to entertain them. We can live according to our free, free will, because Guru Vaishnava always, when you come to, why, don't do this, don't do this, so it's better, ah, useless. Nobody should be there to keep a close watch on our activities. So better Guru Vishnu can, ah, useless, he is not sadhu, he cannot adjust with anybody. Papa speaking, this is why at present there is scarcity of Harikatha, whatever Katha going on, they memorize and speak for half hour, one hour. This is not Harikatha. Harikatha means what you are speaking, what you are doing should be matching. What you are speaking, that you are himself, you yourself following. That is called Harikatha. So this kind of Harikatha, rare. Yeah. Oh, popularity can be there. Thousands of people can subscribe. That doesn't mean one pros can dance open. So thousands of people can walk. That doesn't mean that is very important thing. That doesn't mean a very important thing. In front of Bhaktivinoda Thakur, when Bhaktivinoda Thakur used to speak Harikatha there, Sananda Sukhata Kunj. Many times I used to come from Vindavan speak Harikatha. When Bhaktivinoda Thakur used to speak Harikatha, Krishnadas Babaji Maharaj, I mean his disciple, I Samadhi Mandir, you know, just adjacent Samadhi Mandir, is the same of Krishna Das Bhavajima. I Bhakti Mantra. He used to hear alone, or sometime Gorkisar Bhavaji Maharaj used to cross the river and come, hear Arikatha. Only two. Hello, Krishna Das Bhavaji Maharaj used to hear, and at that time it was total village area. Who can understand what Bhakti Mantra was speaking? No music, no orchestra, who can enjoy? So Bhakti Mantra go that that I have seen that the place, one one you know seat of Bhakti Mantra. Now they break it and make the room. Break it. There Bhakti Mantra used to sit there and speak Harikatha. But now they break that place and make room. This is a condition. So if somebody is going to speak, I like to lead my peaceful life, don't try to disturb me. This is the voice of a passive karma. This can prove that the man has karma. Self-interest, enjoying mood. Otherwise, this kind of word we cannot say. Because a devotee can say, Whatever amount of trouble I need to suffer, I am ready. That is the voice of one devotee. That is the bichar of one devotee. Our Guru Bhargava, Siddhar Gusima, Madhu Gusima, Bhakti Bhakti, they never go against Prabhupada. Even mentally, never. Whatever Prabhupada speaking, they never think, Prabhupada, we are giving too much pressure on us. It is impossible, unbearable, they never told. Follow. The patience, if you can see, somebody has patience in Guru Seva. Tremendous patience, unlimited patience. Is a symptom, memorize, try to remember. Otherwise, everybody can make fool of you. You can say, big, big girl, and oh, it's nice. It's a... But you try to digest this Siddhanta. If you find 
unlimited patience, like Bhakti Bala of Chittu Maharaj. If you beat, insult him, so many God brothers, openly insulting, Maharaj not speaking in this. Bhaman Goswami Maharaj. Follow. Our Bharati Maharaj. Unnecessarily. Bharati Maharaj gone to take bath. They lock the room. Bharati Maharaj cannot enter the room. All clothes, winter season, all is standing. Not shouting. Not shouting like crazy. Not going to policeman. Follow. We should have that kind of... We should have that kind of enduring power. We are not going to approach a police. We have no time. Somebody is speaking, Maharaj is going to steal your library. You can, you have paper, you can go to policeman. Oh, no, I have no time. My, my application already gone unto the lotus feet of Nityananda. Someday you can see. I am not going to this policeman. He is very cheap. I am going to such a power, Prabhu, Nityananda. My application already has submitted unto the Lord Svita, Nityananda Prabhu. So why should I waste my time to go, go to policeman? I wanted to do Guru Shavana by library. Okay, let them steal. The situation can prove. Guru Maharaj give me an idea. Promise, I know. Order me, I have done. Guru Maharaj is watching everything. So a devotee don't like to make any No time actually. So, the main point for why I am making this background, Mukundo was giving severe punishment by Gauranga Mahaprabhu. Chato Haridas was giving severe punishment. Even in dream you cannot be here. You can leave Mahaprabhu and go away. And the, by the by, I forget this. They arrange Bandara. When the prasad is being served, when the prasad is being served, then those devotees, they are watching Shachi Mata, Malini Ma, everything. When the prasad is already there, it is written in Bhakti right? Everything. But they are doing Jayadhani, you know. Mahaprasadi, Govinda. In the meantime, they, they are going to take prasad. In the meantime, they watch. That Sivas Pandit, Malini Ma, Sochi Ma, all. They are watching everything. Because Lila is eternally present. You cannot see. Because we are, by, we are blind. You cannot see. Follow. But Lila is eternally present. Parambaja Siddhar Goswami used to see Gaur Nithananda. You can see the kirtan by Siddha Goswami. You can feel Krishna or Babaji Maharaj. Bhakti Bhakti You can feel directly. They are, they, are, they are watching Krishna, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Otherwise, this kind of kirtan is not possible. Siddha Goswami is doing kirtan. You can see. Or oh, the last time, Gaur Nithai Haribol. Gaur Nithai. Gaur Nithai Hari Bol crying, shedding tears. They are watching Gaur Nithai. This is not their ordinary kirtan. Like, like one man doing kirtan for taking money, these are not that. Kishodas Babaji Maharaj, Bhakti Pumat Purigashi Maharaj. You can see their kirtan, what they are doing. So, still today, I promise you, Still today, you can watch everything, provided you are going up to that level. I was not. So, Choto Haridas, small Haridas was given severe punishment. Even you cannot, uh, in dream you cannot see this kind of punishment, externally. Mukunda was given punishment. Today, Mukunda Datta, his Avirbhav Tichi today, Mukunda Dattva and Vasudev Dattva, both of them are brother. Brother, they are 
Vasudev Dattva is elder brother and Mukundo Dattva is younger brother. They took birth in, Chatt in Chattagram, at present in Bangladesh. But they are eternal persons of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. They has to come here. So they are coming here. From very small boyhood, they are reading in school, you know, that time Gurukul. And Chaitanya Mahaprabhu same. The age, regarding age factor, Gauranga Mahaprabhu age and Mukunda almost same. They are friend. Same school. They are under the guidance of the same Guru. But Mahaprabhu is Bhagavan, he is devotee. They can understand each other, but this still they are doing some Leela. This Mukunda Dattva and Basud, Bas, Basudev Dattva, elder brother, they are the eternal person of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. At the same time, they are the eternal person of Radha Govinda. Why? Because both of them, they used to sing song. Both of them, they used to sing song there in the assembly of Nanda Maharaj. If you go to Jamkitan, you can find after Krishna come, coming back from posturing field, I mean cow, I know, coming back with cows, after that taking bath, everything, going to Gosala to milching, and Gomata, without watching Krishna, they cannot give milk. They are licking the body of Krishna. When they see Krishna, they are dancing. All cows. So Nanda Maharaj, Nanda Maharaj always expect Krishna and Balaram to come directly in Gosala. I went to the Gosala, Nanda Maharaj. Gosala is there, but now you cannot have a material idea you can have. It's a big area. But now at present you can have a small area. They make this. After that, from Gosala, it was the rules that Jasodama can take sending servant to bring Krishna Balaram. They are hungry, giving prasadam. After prasadam is over, they are supposed to go to the assembly of Nanda Maharaj. Nanda Maharaj king is sitting in the in the chair. Nanda Maharaj and Balaram, both of them, is a prince, prince, because Though Balaji Maharaj is not the son of Nanda Baba, but still Nanda Baba never think. Never think. Nanda Baba used to think is my own son. So, at the time of nomenclature, when Gargamuni wanted to give name, new name, whose name is this boy, which name, this boy, at the set, that time you can find that Balaram is sitting in the lap of Nanda Baba. He used to love very much. I mean, same. Krishna Balaram, not, not that he is separate, he is separate. Not. So both of them, after taking prasadam, it was the rules. Now this time, evening time, late evening, after late evening, they used to go to that assembly and every day, they used to hear some noble, some writings by written by somebody or somebody dancing, singing. Every day some or other kind of function was there. But king, nah, in front of king, somebody dancing, somebody is singing, because king going to give some donation to them. So these two, I mean, Mukunda Dotto and Vasudev Dotto, they are the eternal person of Krishna, in Krishna also. They are the Madhu Kanto and Snigdha Kanto. You never heard. Madhu Kanto and Snigdha Kanto. They are both a singer, singer, very nice singer. And Nandabara used to enjoy. Are you sing? Because Krishna Valaram like it. So at the time of Krishna, at the time of you know Nandabhava, they are the singer. And now also both of them used to sing for the complete satisfaction of Gauranga Even before Gauranga Mahapu manifested his realm, 
Gauranga Mahaprabhu Lila is already manifested from part. But still, everybody could not realize he is Supreme Lord. Advaita Goswami could realize sometime, or sometime used to make some testing purposely. So that time, at the assembly of Advaita Gosai, almost daily, not daily, all the time, after education is over, uh, school education, they used to come in the assembly of Advaita Gosai, they used to sing song, and all devotees, they used to shed tears. Mukunda Dattu never used to sing material song. He, by birth, he was a great devotee. He used to sing Kirtan for the satisfaction of Krishna. And Mahaprabhu purposely used to joke with him. After school time is over, they are going back. Mahaprabhu used to catch the hand. Hey, today you will have to give answer to my question. What? Logic, logic, you know? Nay, nay. Mahaprabhu was a master of logic. Na? Mukunda speaking, you leave me, I have so on. No, you are first of all, you have to give answer to my logic. I mean, Tarka, I mean, nay. Then you can go. Mukunda speaking, always material talking. Mahaprabhu purposely doing. That's why when Mukunda watching, when Mukunda watching, Nima is there, Mukunda used to pass away to other way. What used to avoid? Then Nimai, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu used to laugh. Oh, when he is coming to me, there is no Harikatha. That's why he is going to pass away. He is Vaishnava. Well, someday I can become such a big Vaishnava. A whole world can come to me. <laughs> Mahaprabhu joking. Even all Sankar Brahma can come. Eh? He is going to pass away. Amar Kothai Nahi. Krishna Prasango. In my talkings, there is no topics of Krishna. That's why he is going to pass away me. So, okay. Well, someday, someday I can become such a great Vaishnava. Even Brahma, Sankar, all can make a queue. <laughs> Follow. It's true. Bhagavan purposely making joke. So, when Mahaprabhu manifested him directly, when everybody could realize there is a Supreme Lord, because in Siva Sangam, forehand, everything, all. From then onward, Mukundo started following Gauranga like a shadow. From then, he could realize. Because Mukundo was very intelligent. It was Mukundo who took Gadadhar Pandit to meet with one Vaishnava. I told you, na? that is Pandurik Vidyanidhi. But Gadadhar Pandit make, making one Leela, it was one Leela. Gadadhar Pandit Radharani, he could not understand Pundari. He is a Vaishnava. So much appliance is there. Chewing pan, there is golden pot. <laughs> eh? All And all servants, they are going to play hand pan. Like majestic arrangement, like a king. Eh? All white, you know. Costly bed, pillow. And all back brass here, costly chandan, tail. <laughs> all in the room, there is a symptom of appliances. To Godada speaking, Mukundo Prabhu taking me, I mean bring me to meet with Vaishnava. Better if I could, you know, I am meeting with this, this Vaishnava. How I can? Wish? In the meantime, Mukundo could realize the mood of Kadadhar, to expose the fact, the who is this, you misunderstand him. After that, Mukundu started singing two Bhagavad Sloka only. Baraha piram natavarabapu karnayo karnikaram vidhadavasakanaka kubisam vaijayan tinchamalam randhana bena radhar sudaya pura yano gopa bindvai Vrindarannam sapadaramanam pravishad gita kirti bas. One stroke is sufficient. Krishna coming back from posturing field, the Leela from Bhagavatam. Mukundo could understand the mood of Gadadhar misunderstand. He, 
he cannot understand how great this devotee is. He started singing, then immediately what happened? That Pundarik Vidyanidhi fall down from the bed, bedstead, all going to tear up, all this nice like son in law, all, all clothed like son in law, back brass hair. But now going to tear up, where is my Krishna? Then Godadar Pandit could realize, oh, I misunderstood him by watching his offenses. He's a great devotee. Sometimes some devotee, like Janak Maharaj, like Judishir Maharaj, like Prithu Maharaj, like Ambarish Maharaj, externally, for the satisfaction of Bhagavan. Follow. Dubha Maharaj Pallava. They say, we don't want to sit in, we don't want to sit in the, in the helm, I mean chair of king. Bhagavan says, no, you will have to sit. It is myself. So, Yudhishthir Maharaj sitting in the chair of king simply because Krishna becomes satisfied. But we don't understand. We see so much of friends, how is possible, Vaishnava? Then Niskinchan inside, Bhaktivinoda Thakur, majestic arrangement, so much court, everything. But they don't know, he's a great devotee. Who can understand Bhaktivinoda Thakur? Eh? Very nice coat and in this was so tamad, everything. But he is a great devotee, nobody can understand. Nobody can understand. Sometimes devotees, they are keeping their Niskinchan Bhav secretly. Sometimes some devotee, like Prabhupada, he used to keep his Niskinchan Bhav secretly. Don't Externally, he is going to put on court, everything, talk with, you know, Lord, Lord Sai, British people, in English, very nice, like smart. Turban here. Follow. Bhaktivinoda Thakur, Prabhupada. They used to learn. It is called secret seva mood of Radharani. Radharani used to seek nice clothes, externally not showing Bhayaga. So those who are following Brajagopikas, usually they are going to follow the rules and regulations shown by Radharani. Radharani never wanted to show Niskin Janba. Oh, no clothes, nothing. All is using ornament, everything. Why? For the seva of Krishna, for the satisfaction of Krishna. What it concerns to Krishna, if I am going to recite hundred sloka in the morning, ah! Krishna wants to see how much you love. Are you are reciting sloka, I am very hungry. Give me immediately. What is more important? You can decide slow, Krishna can become happy. Or Jasodama from morning time can give butter and milk. Ah, he is very hungry. What is more important? Or Jasodama can let me chant one lakh Harinam first, then I'm going to. Or Radharani can say, Oh, first of all, I can chant one lakh Harinam. After that, I can. Ah, which stage of time? Seva is more important. One foolish international Acharya, I'm not going to name. International in the sense he used to preach. He used to preach everywhere. Name is not so important. I am not going to insult anybody. I, he is going to advise to his disciple why you are cooking, why you are worshipping is wastage of time. Our Gurudev told only do chant Hari now. He used to preach everywhere. And externally he was successful, but he is giving advice to disciple. He is speaking to me. I mean, who told? But he is speaking, I am worshipping everything, his disciple speaking, you are wastage of time. I only do Harinam. Ani? Bonded soul cannot do Harinam. Bonded soul cannot do Harinam properly. First of all, they will have to do Seva. After Seva, when they grow seva mood, they can do harina. So they will have to do seva. Guru Vishnu always engages them in seva. But they are speaking lie. Just opposite. Just opposite. It's not good. So, one, one signal, try to understand, is very gravity. Don't think otherwise. What I mean to say, very, very important thing. 
one wrong signal can make a big accident. Just two days ago, three tens collide with each other. Coromandel Express, Jashobandh Express, good tens, all hundreds of people die for one negligence of one signal man. Negligence of one signal man. You are worried about it. But you are no, not worried about one Acharya who is speaking wrong. So foolish you are. So I am giving this example. Your, as an Acharya, your wrong Siddhanta Vichar can destroy the whole world. Try to be, understand. As an Acharya, uh, my wrong Siddhanta can destroy the whole world, devotional field. I should teach you how to love Guru Vishnu. If I teach you how to hate Guru Vishnu, this is not Acharya Sip. Bhakti Mnath Thakur, Bhakti Mnath Thakur writing in Kirtan, Vaishnava Vishwas Vidhi Hog Khane Khane. Every fraction of second, Bhakti Mnath Thakur speaking to Bhagavan. Bhagavan, every fraction of second, you help me to increase the faith in Guru Vaishnava. Vishwas. Vaishnava Vishwas Vidhi Hog Khane Khane, Bengali. So Bhakti Mnath Thakur paying, paying to Gaurang Mahapur, E Prabhu. You bless me so that I can increase faith in Guru Vaishnava day by every fraction of second. Every fraction of second, I like to increase my faith in Guru Vaishnava. But as an Acharya, you are teaching, every fraction of second, you can lose faith in Guru Vaishnava. But nobody there, complain. Nobody there. Who is going to speak? Every fraction of second, he can, he can arrange, so that every fraction of second, you can lose bhakti, faith, Unto a lotus feet of Guru Vaishnava, but thousands of people following them. I am rascal number one. Like a dog, I am barking. It's Siddhanta. It's not the question of fighting. There should not be any particular. It's question of a survival of your real self. You are going to die by false information. So one wrong signal going to destroy, devastate it. So one wrong signal, I mean Siddhanta Vija, indication by one Acharya can destroy the whole Vaishnava. They cannot get bhakti. They can dance like monkey, but they cannot get bhakti. Bhakti is a separate thing. Bhakti is such a thing that even by spending crores of money, dollars, you cannot get bhakti. By using all your educational power, manpower, money power, Whatever you have, you just challenge, but still you cannot get one drop of bhakti, not possible. So Chaitanya Mahaprabhu wanted to make us alert by giving punishment to Mukundo. Bhakti Muntra was speaking, Mukundo is not such a devotee whom Gauranga Mahaprabhu can give punishment. Bhakti Muntra was speaking in a writing. It is one kind of game, Bhakti Muntagu writing. Mukundo making mistake. Huh? Mukundo singing song from his childhood, giving satisfaction to Gauranga Mahaprabhu. All the time, Nityananda, Gauranga, always dancing. Mukundo, when singing, is the best singer. In other part, not even Rathiya, not the time of Rathiya, all the time. Mukundo is like shadow all the time. All the time, Mukunda. So you see, you, you can understand the seva of Mukundo, but still, Mahaprabhu to teach us, going to give punishment to Mukundo. When Mahaprabhu going to express his Ishwar Bab, Mahaprabhu used to express sometime Ishwar Bab, sometime Gopi Bab. Sometimes Radharani Bab, sometimes Gopi Bab, Manjari Bab, time to time. But you cannot understand. Those pure devotees can give, all can explain 
and can, they, then you can understand. Oh, this time it is the Mahaprabhu was the mood of Radharani. Oh, really? Oh, that time it was the mood of uh, some manjari. Time to time it differs. So when Mahaprabhu first expressed his mood here in Shiva Sangam, then Mahaprabhu started giving prema to everybody. Brahmaro Durla Prem. Even Brahma Sankar begging one drop that was distributed openly by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Which is, which is rare for Brahma Sankar or rare, most rare. But that was distributed by Gauranga Mahaprabhu freely to everybody. At the time of Krishna, there was some restriction. But still, Krishna, Rupa Goswami was writing, except Krishna, who wanted to give prema to even to creepers, creepers, you know, trees and keepers, except Krishna, who is there? So merciful. Rupa Goswami wrote. It was Krishna, he used to best to keep on trees and trees and, you know, creepers, even the deer, sea deer, he deer, cows, I used to give prema. But not like Gauranga Mahaprabhu openly. Because Radharani is there inside Gauranga. Gauranga means Radharani. So Radharani is more, you know, practical. Na? Because Radharani, Prem is the only treasure of Radharani. Prem. Follow as a guru. So, when Gauranga Mahaprabhu came here, molten gold, this kind of mercy, never seen in the creation, in the creation, even in Shatta Yuga, Teta Yuga, never, no. Dapar Yuga, no. This kind of prema is rare. He wanted to distribute to everyone. Even Muslim people, cruel Muslim people, Follow. One Muslim ruler, one Muslim ruler going to send their people, hey, you go, help, help this sannyasi to cross over this river. Pishalda. You open Chaitanya Charitamrita, you are blind, you cannot see. You open, you can see. I can show you. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu going to cross the river in Pishalda. Then the Muslim ruler going to, hey, you go, help. Help that sannyasi. Very nice looking. You can help. That the boat, that Muslim, you know, people is cruel, going to help Mahaprabhu cross the river only. After the, after the river is already crossed, Mahaprabhu going to step down eh, from that boat. But the Muslim man going to fall down. He cannot bear the separation of God. Can you imagine? Inconceivable. Inconceivable, even by watching Chaitanya Mahaprabhu long distance, one animal, tiger, you know, elephant, you know, lion, all. By watching Chaitanya Mahaprabhu, they get getting prema. So, all the wives, all the wives of Raja Pratabharuddha, King Pratabharuddha, they are watching Chaitanya Mahaprabhu for long distance. It is not the rules. One Matajis can come in front of sannyasis, give garland, by at present all Acharya are taking. It is not a rule. One Acharya cannot take garland from one woman. They can stay long distance. This is the rule uh, shown by Gorang Mahaprabhu. We cannot break the rules. We cannot hate Matajis. We love Matajis from heart. But still we we'll have to follow some restrictions shown by Gorang Mahaprabhu. No? By at present, I can show you a picture. I am getting guard. I am Mataji is coming, giving guard. It's not rules. It's not the teachings of Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Prabhupada never saw. Bhakti Mithra never saw. So, it is written Patra patra vicharanam na kurute na sa param vikshate. Deya deo ba vimarsak na hi na ba kala pratiksha prabhu. Shaddo Savanekshana Panamana Dhyana Dina Durlabam Datte Bhakti Rasam 
So Gauru may the sloka. Follow. Whom to give prema, whom not to give prema, this judgment is over. Now free distribution. Even by watching Mahaprabhu from distance, long distance, those wives of Pathapruddha, they are sitting on elephant. And Mahaprabhu goes, Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna, Krishna Krishna, Hare Hare. Going, they are watching from long distance. In prema, they are shedding tears by watching Mahaprabhu. What to speak about human being, even animal. So Bhakti Mantra was speaking, this kind of punishment given by Gauranga Mahapu is one kind of Leela. Bhakti Mantra was speaking, this kind of punishment given by Mahaprabhu Tumukunda, one kind of Leela. What kind of punishment? Mahaprabhu distributing prema to everybody, but not calling Mukunda. Mukunda is outside veranda. Mahapukundo thinking I am fallen soul, when Prabhu can call, then I can go. I am not calling Prabhu. Prabhu expressing, all distributing. Then I was Sridhar Pandit speaking, Prabhu, you are not calling, a, you are not calling Mukundo standing outside for a long time, eh? waiting for your keeper. I cannot give keeper to him. Why, why, why? He is doing so much seva to you. I cannot give keeper. Because whenever he is going to any assembly, he is going jai 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 speaking. He is making adjustment. Whenever he is going to Gani Sampradaya, he is going, ah, you are nice. When he is coming to Vaishnava Sampradaya, ah, you are nice. He is making some adjustment. I cannot allow him. This kind of procedure is not allowed by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So we will have to become strict. Some people can complain that Mahasya is so strict and his strictness is shown by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. If there is no strictness, if you become liberal regarding, oh, no problem, it's, uh, my heart is very liberal, not that. Your heart is very conservative. He like to guide people towards hell. You are very clever. You are foolish, not clever. Externally you are clever, you are foolish. So, conservative attitude is quite natural. To protect my sampradaya, to protect our Siddhanta Vichara, I must be strict. And a strictness is not made by Mina. I am going to manufacture strictness. I am not going to, because I am going to follow Prabhupada Bhakti Strictness shown by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. So, strictness is also given by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. If you are not going to follow, strictness regarding your satsanga, regarding your seva, if you are not going to, regarding your harikatha kirtan, if you are not going to follow strictness, then you can become sahajya. Today or tomorrow, you can become sahajya. Sahajya means, you can fall down. Strictness means, strictness means, strictness means, you will have to give some, give some protection. Strictness is nothing. Strictness means you will have to keep some protection around you. So that no sahajya can come, no contaminate our harikatha. That's why we are so foolish. Countless kirtan written by Narutam Thakur, Bhaktim Thakur. But we are foolish, number one. Wasting our time. Bhaktim Thakur wrote, na? What wrote? Eh? Pratipa janere asita nadibo rakhibo garero pare. You don't sing Kirtan. You know this Kirtan. You don't know. Never sing. Why not singing? Tumito Thakur, Tomar Kukur, Boliya Jano Homore. Never you singing. But you are. Eh? Why you are not singing? Bhaktivinoda you are writing. About Guru Vaishnava, I am the dog of Guru Vaishnava. I cannot allow any wrong Siddhanta Vichar, any Sahajya, those who are against Guru Vaishnava, I cannot allow them. I can stay like a dog, faithful dog in the gate. Whenever somebody coming just, you know, against Guru Vaishnava, we can say, go, 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 ah, go away. Follow. Bhakti Muta Guru We can drive them away. Don't disturb Guru Vaishnava. Go, go away. 
They come in to disturb. Eh? Follow. So this kirtan you should do. What I am speaking, all supported by Bhakti Mahatma Gandhi told. So strictness is a must to protect our Guru Varga, our Siddhanta Vichar, our Sampradaya. If I am not strict, then Maya Devi can kick on my chest and throw. Maya Devi. She is the servant of Bhagavan Sri Krishna. Today I was speaking, na? Jaya San Mahitam Jagatam. Eh? I was speaking, noon time. So Maya Devi. So strictness is not bad quality. Strictness means that Vaishnava is good. He likes to protect our sampradayic dignity. If I like to protect sampradayic dignity, I must make some protection around me so that foolish people cannot come. I don't need number. Pure Vaishnava that never count any number of followers. Pure Vaishnava always counting one or two who is now prepared enough so that I can offer this flower, Jivatma, and to the lotus feet of Krishna. Who is going to attain that quality? I am speaking Harikatha. Who is that Jivatma going to attain that kind of quality so that I can take this flower, Jivatma, and offer to Krishna? If they are busy with money, oh, cheap money. We need money for construction, okay. But money is cheap thing. But for this cheap thing, which can be compared with stool and urine, which can be compared with stool and urine, if it is not used for Krishna Seva. If for money, you are busy, you like to steal some money, what you can do? Okay, you steal. Follow. It's very dangerous. So for this, for this, only for this stool and urine, we are going to, we are going to destroy our Vaishnava society. Only for some stool and urine, public giving some La Puja Patishtha. Public giving, no? Public giving me La Puja Patishtha, give God, you are the international preacher, you are the Jagat Guru, speaking. It's called stool and urine. Only for this stool and urine, you are going to act as a, you know, traitor of Gauriya Mat. Just for stool and urine. I could give you so much stool and urine is there. Only for getting stool and urine, you wanted to sell, you wanted to sell the Siddhanta which are of Gauriya, Gauriya Mat, everything you wanted to sell, library, everything, for your little Patishta. Stool and urine, which is available everywhere. A pure Bhagavad you cannot understand their mood. Follow. So Mukundo was given punishment. Mahapu speaking, when Siva is requesting repeatedly, then Mahaprabhu speaking, well, after one crore of birth, I can do kipa to him. One crore of birth after. Not now. Mukundo started dancing. Cloth going on, only naked, dancing. Ah, Prabhu. Prabhu said, why he is dancing? Why? Because he is dancing with full enjoyment. Because confirmation certificate you give in, huh? one crores of life after. <laughs> oh, really? You bring it, bring it, bring it. Mukunda, come to me. No, Prabhu, I cannot go. I am a fallen soul. One crores of life, I can go on crying, crying and crying to get your lotus feet. That is far better. Prabhu saying, you don't know. Now your one crores of life, you already cross over. You come to me. I can give keep up. Because of strong faith, strong faith, that one crore of life after Mahaprabhu can give you, his confirmation certificate. So he is dancing. So your one crore of years gone. Because time, space and time, space and matter, all regulated by Bhagavan. Their servant. Many such incidents I have no time to speak. Many such incidents I can speak. One example I can see. One Brahma Ratto, then one night time period of Brahma was just like fraction of second for Gopikas during the Rasa Leela time. All other example I can speak. No time now. This way Mukundo was the topmost 
Sevak of Gauranga Mahaprabhu. But still, Mahaprabhu wanted to give punishment. This is one kind of kripa. You know Siddhar, Siddhar, Pandit Siddhar Maharasi. You know Siddhar, Kholavacha Siddhar used to say there. Mahaprabhu used to bestow kripa to him, 100%, so much kripa. Even when Mahaprabhu was going to express Ishwar Baba, he used to call Siddhar to me. Siddhar coming. Siddhar watching. He is the same Brahman boy who used to fight with me with green banana and the uh, you know, inside portion of you know, me, uh, you know, banana tree, Thor collar and leaf, banana leaf. He used to fight with me every day in the market. And that is, is Ishwar. Siddha started <laughs> shaking, fall down on ground. Siddha come to me, huh? you are that, you are that Brahman boy with me, you used to fight with me. Now I see what I see. But ah, I am that. I told you now in joking. I told you in joking. You are spending so much money to worship Ganga. Better you worship me. Ah, you are Brahman boy, you don't fear Ganga. Hey, you are speaking this kind of thing, no bhakti. Gauranga Mahaprabhu said, why you are worshipping Ganga? You worship me, more practical. Huh? You are speaking this way? <laughs> but Siddhar could not realize Mahaprabhu speaking the fact. Now realize, oh, now I realize why you used to say, you are spending so much money and flower garland to Ganga. Better you can give to me, because Ganga coming from my lotus feet eh? Ganga coming from your lotus feet eh? you are Brahman boy no bhakti you are speaking this way rubbish but now Siddhar going to watch Mahaprabhu and shaking body follow after 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 expressing Kipa to Kaji Kaji you know the Brahmin ruler that time Kaji Mahaprabhu going this way and going to the Siva's heart, you know, broken, all a different. Siva is not sleeping, no bed, nothing, no water pot, no place. Oh, only doing Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. People are disgusted, ha, useless, as out of hang hungry attitude, shouting Hare Krishna, Hare Krishna. Oh, don't allow us to sleep peacefully. <laughs> but they don't know who is Mahaprabhu going there after giving kippa to. Kaji, Mahaprabhu coming this way and going to the baranda of Siddhar, I am thirsty. Is there any water? Uh, watching one iron pot with a very leakage, all different places. I mean, all repetition. Repeat, repeat. This leakage, they repeat by metal. <laughs> Mahaprabhu going to take that water pot and drink it. I am going to die. Is the way. Useless water I am keep outside. Oh my God. But Mahaprabhu is going to take that water outside water from Siddhar Baranda and drinking. This is the love of Gauranga Mahaprabhu for his devotees. If you realize, you in infinity period, never you can feel angry attitude to leave Mahaprabhu and his devotee. When you cannot realize the excellent kripa of Prabhu, Krishna never saw this kind of kripa. Useless water kept outside, Siddhar is going to take this water. So you understand the Kripa of So if I go on speaking, it will take huge amount of time. Anyway, today is also Isnan Yatra. I must touch this point also. Otherwise, my speech is not complete. Because today is the Sun Yatra. Now I have no time to go. Previously, I used to go forcefully to Sanjat. Now, no time. If I go, I cannot make up time here and there, no time. No, no time to save. If I go to save, I can miss that seva. There is a condition, mind. Appointment there, no? already they are saying, this time you can come, this time you can come. Oh, I, can. I have to check all the, what their construction going on. So, today is the day. Now, first of all, you can, under, you can ask me, what is the inner meaning of this Snanjatra? First, want to know. Snanjatra of Jagannath, it is a Snanjatra of Jagannath. Manda means Jagannath is going to take bath. It's 
literal meaning. But actually, today is the day, Jaishta Purnima. Today is the day when Jagannath appeared in this world. Today is the day. I mean, long history, I cannot say. When Jagannath came in the form of log, wooden log, after the Daru Brahma, after that, Jagannath manifests his Leela inside closed room. Follow. So long history, I cannot speak now. So by chance, it was the instruction of Jagannath that today I can appear. So Jagannath today appeared, today is the day, Tithi, when Jagannath appeared. In this world. I mean, Jagannath Balaji Subhadra, you watching in the temple? Today is a day. Appeared. It was, the, uh, it was the instruction of Jagannath to Indo Dumna Maharaj. Indo Dumna Maharaj. That you can find one well. Well, you know, where water available. Where all, the, all, all different impo important pilgrimage and all water. Not only Ganga, Jumuna, Saraswati, not that. Kaveri, Gange, Jumuna, Chayuva, Gadavari, Saraswati, Narvade, Sindhu. Eh? All water there you can get. How possible? Yes, possible. And no connection, Maharaj. How in the pot? Everything possible. Why not possible? Even Krishna speaking to Nanda Baba. Father, why you are taking trouble to go for this? You are now grown up, my boy. Now you are grown up. So, for some time I can go for different pilgrimage to take bath in Ganga Jumana. Why you are going to take trouble unnecessarily? If I can show all pilgrimage here in Pavan Sarabhar, eh? how possible are uh, you wet? You take bath, I am saying. All pilgrimage coming, Ganga, Jamuna, Saraswati, Kaveri, or paying Dandavat to Nanda Baba and going inside water. What is that? Pavan Sarabhar. You know Pavan Sarabhar? You don't know? Are you foolish? <laughs> Pavan Sarvar in Nanda, Nanda Gam, Pavan Sarvar. At the bank of Nanda Sarvar, Sanatana Gosai, I used to stay there also. By the mercy of Bhagavan. They are speaking Harikatha, Nanda Gam, the Bhajan Kutir of Sanatana. That time I was just like beggar. I also, today I am a beggar. <laughs> no clothes, nothing. Only running here and there, speak Harikatha. Very nice feeling. <laughs> Follow. Very nice. That life was very good. And today also I am very happy. I am not... <laughs> so this life is separate. That time Bhagavan. So, Nanda Baba, after watching the all pilgrimage coming and giving identity, then Nanda Baba you know, was bound to stop decision to go to different pilgrimage. Now, the point I say, Bhagavan speaking to Indodumna Maharaj, you can find one well inside that area. That, that well is very important. All pilgrimage, their water is there. You can get a golden pitcher. Follow. So today is the day. From that long time, this, is, this has been the rules. So today also, they are going to... One, one day I can remember. That time Guru Mahaj was in Puri, old age. Follow. Guru Mahaj said, you cannot go for Snanjatra. I can go. They are by your blessing. How I can enter? Oh, you can try if they allow you. Oh, they take. So by the mercy of Guru Mahaj, I am coming. I find there is big queue. Thousands of people. How I can go? They cannot allow me. Somehow, by the mercy of Guru Dev, I get entry into the temple without money. I have no money. I cannot ask money from Guru Dev. They pay a huge amount. Once, you know, I have no money. I go inside. After that, we are watching Jagannath going to the altar. I am thinking, they cannot allow me to go to altar. How I can go? Impossible. There is cordon. Cordon, you know, policeman. All cordon, big cordon. I am thinking by Gurudev, how I can go to take? They cannot allow me. They can beat me if I go. That time age was very <laughs> young age. So one time one guard was unmindful. One, 
One time I saw one guardman was unmindful. Immediately I cross the crowd and run. And that the man shouting, I, I, excuse me. <laughs> he is not speaking anything. By the mercy of Gurudev. I break the cordon, I go down and run towards that altar. And whole day I'm watching Jagannath, Bhagavad Sevadra, all the arrangement there. Oh, so nice arrangement. Golden pot all. Jagannath, Bhagavad Subhadra, all of So, many such Ratha Yatra, at the time of Titha Gosimaya Bhaktivala, he used to go. And that time, body power is very high. If you, if you fall down in this crowded, you know, then you can, you can make, they can make you a pest. Pest, you know? <laughs> they can make you a pest. At that time, body was so high. We, so much jostling. Go in front of Jagannath. Nobody can stop. There's cordon, you know. That time was possible. Tithu Maharaj was there. He used to do kirtan. So much prasadam, lot of prasadam you can take. Oh, lot of prasadam. Whatever you like, you can take. All open to all. <laughs> because Madhav Gusi Maharaj, Tithu Gusi Maharaj, they are liver. Oh, everybody, open to all. <laughs> you can take whatever you like. Follow. Very. So we enjoy in our life. Enjoyment? A prakita enjoyment. God. So now thinking, what is the situation at present? Who can give this love? Who can give this kind of love? I'm now thinking, what to do? So today is the day when it was the order of Jagannath to Indodumna Raja. You, you can take both. Uh, you can take all me, Balaram, my get, my elder brother, and Subhadra into the altar. And all golden pot you can carry 108 pot golden pots of water from that. And make it scented. Very, very costly. Costly scent. Very costly. Kasturi, this, that. Oh, so scented water. After that, you can arrange first or save everything. After that, all they can. And Brahma also. Bhagavan told you can also uh, arrange bathing of Brahma. And Sudarshan also. All the Sudarshan. Whole people can watch that Sranjatra from outside. Because the altar is in, in such a position, if Jagannath, Balurav, Subhadra, if they are kept in an altar, outside lakhs of people can see. By high, very high. From there you can watch all going on. So anyway, day by day people become material. They are going to lose faith in Guru Vaishnava, Bhagavan. Aprakita Ananda. Follow. So, after Jagannath taking bath, 108 pots of cold water, scented water, Chandan, Kasturi, all everything. Golden pot. Golden pot na, golden pitcher. Golden pitcher. They are going to Jagannath. Baladev Subhadra. After the bathing is over, then naturally, the color become fed. Jagannath looking tired after taking bath, so much bath. Jagannath develop fear, a uh, fever. Jagannath develop fever. Oh, after taking so much bath, you know, develop fever like human being. Like Chaitanya Mahaprabhu when went to Goya. Oh, big fever. A doctor, no solution. If the doctor, they bring doctor, Ayurvedic doctor, they have no solution. Finally, Mahaprabhu said, well, you can go and find some pure Brahman and wash the lotus feet and bring water. I can drink uh, my fever. This is my medicine. Same thing Krishna told. In Daruka, I'm fever. Headache. Oh, a headache can go if you go. If somebody, pure devotee, going to give the water wash, uh, and nobody giving. But in Vrindavan, when going, oh, Krishna is very sick. Yeah, Krishna is sick. Yes. No doctor can give treatment. He is speaking the only medicine the water was upon, you know, Brajavasi. Brajagopika, how much, how, much, how much you need? You take. You take from us. If Krishna is happy by applying our dust particle form, I am ready. We can go to hell, no problem. But Krishna become happy. It's more practical. So you take how much dust particle or water was we knew. You take and go. 
and make our Krishna healthy. We want to see Krishna healthy all the time. So, Chaitanya Mahaprabhu doing this kind of lila. What a rush of one Brahman drinking after their death, that fever is over. Follow. Similarly, it is the order of Jagannath that after this bathing is over, I mean from today onward, 15 days you cannot open the screen in front of public. Because all my painting, everything, all, you know, all they can misunderstand. Ugly looking. So you can keep inside and due to my fever, you can give some medicine, Ayurvedic medicine. So those pandas, they are making some medicine. They are boiling and making some medicine and giving in front of Jagannath. That is also available. I already took. Pachan. It's called Pachan. You take, you can take. Very, and it's very, <laughs> it's very, so many things there. Yeah. So, this is Ayurvedic medicine. So, for 15 days, Jagannath took decision not to give darshan to anybody. So, he is going to stay inside. During that time, Jagannath only using medicine and paramanna. Hot paramanna giving and paramanna taking. Follow. After that, the first opening is called Netro Sop. In Jagannath, in Chaitanya Chaitanya, you can find. When the new painting, everything done, Jagannath become very fresh with new clothes and everything. Body now okay, fever over. Then Mahaprabhu, Jagannath going to give darshan to everybody. That was the Leela shown by Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. At the day of, at the day of past opening, what kind of enjoyment Gauranga Mahaprabhu is showing? Ah, today is the first darshan, Netu Sap. Whole day Mahaprabhu dancing all around. All devotees, Mukundo, all. Advaita was there all around Jagannath temple. Oh, today I was so happy Prabhu going to give. And when Prabhu, while it's 15 days, there is no darshan of Jagannath. So Mahaprabhu told, I cannot be here. Better I can go to Alamnath, 18 kilometers away, 20 kilometers away. I've been there many times. It's called, what is called? Alamnath. It is established by one Alwar for South India, 400 devotees. Mahaprabhu say, I cannot be a separation of Jagannath. Better I can go and stay there. So Mahaprabhu for 15 days is going to stay there. After 15 days over, 15 days over, Mahaprabhu immediately running, running to take all devotees and going to meet with Jagannath. After watching what is the Baba of Jagannath, if you, if you understand someday, you can go mad. So this is called Snan Jatra. There is so many Jatra. Not only Rathi Yatra, Chandan Jatra, Rathi Yatra. So many. I cannot count. I don't know. So many things. So many Jatra there. Those Panda, they also cannot count. In written there, some. Even those Pandas, they cannot remember. They are following the chart anyway. So today is a very good day. Usually I go there to do, give water to Jagannath and speaking Harikatha, but now at a time, morning time Harikatha, after that Harikatha, after that go to Leva, come here, so I cannot make up time. So I want to see Jagannath from here anyway. So the slok, first slok, I couldn't explain in front of you. I couldn't explain in front of you the first slok. What is the slok I started with? Huh? I started with the slok, you forget. <laughs> anyway. Jeva mai se kito sau hidartha Jane shudehan taravarti keshu Gehe sujayat mojarati matsu Na priti jukta javadartha shaloke Vancha Galpadaru Shakyapa, Sindhi Bhavacha, Pati Tanang Pavana Pavishna Pyu. Only you can search whole world and find one man who likes to hear absolute truth. One or two. One or two you search whole world. If they will like to hear absolute truth, then you can very angry. 